new words, new strength with endless possibilities. Here comes Isabel with the thought of the day. Good morning dear teachers and friends. Today's thought of the day is chase your dreams passionately and find the path to success. Take up one idea. Make that one idea your life. Let the brain, the body muscles, nerves, every part of the body be full of that idea. And just leave other ideas alone. This is way to success and this is the way great spiritual gains are produced. Be the servant while leading. Be unselfish. Have infinite patterns and success is yours. Thank you. Now let's watch a speech about today's topic showcasing the importance and relevance of National Youth Day and contribution of Swami Vivekananda. Respected CEO, principal, teachers and my dear friends. A very warm good morning to all. Today I am going to speak a few words about the National Youth Day. National Youth Day is celebrated 12th January being the birthday of Swami Vivekananda. The government of India in 1984 announced this day celebrated as National Youth Day in India every year since from 1985. Youth is a remarkable and massive gift of life. They are the strength of society and the future of a nation. It is a lifetime experience that shapes an individual. Youth marks different ways according to the various cultural perspectives and creates the level of dependency. At this specific phase of life, the youths are always driven by freedom, liberty and fantasy. The youngsters feel the power to speak and expressing their views without any fear. The youth also plays an important role in building the nation. The future of the country mostly depends on them. Every youth is equally responsible for the country's future as they represent it at every level. They are like building blocks for the country. As the youth are very energetic and enthusiastic, their ability to learn new skills and adapt to the environment is quite good. They have an urge to learn and act accordingly that will help them to achieve their goals. Now, I am concluding my words by saying that youth is the best period in an individual's life. One must cherish their dreams, develop a passion and start working towards their aim of the life. Youth must keep their eyes wide open and protect themselves from any harm. An issue that is bothering must be discussed and acknowledged. Your youth must always remember they are not alone and they play a critical role in the development of society. Thank you and have a nice day. Swami Vivekananda is one of the greatest spiritual leaders of India. Let's have a look at famous few quotes of Swami Vivekananda. Arise, awake and stop not until the goal is achieved. Be a hero. Always say I have no fears. Who is helping you? Don't forget them. Who is loving you? Don't hate them. Who is believing you? Don't cheat them. Strength is life. Weakness is death. Expansion is life. Contraction is death. Love is life. Hatred is death. Let's watch a book review by Daniel George from Grade 5. Good morning everyone. Today I will be doing a book review on Diary of a Wimpy Kid, The Deep End. In this book, Greg and his family go for a cross-country camping trip in their RV. But they find themselves stranded in an RV park that's not very private. When a skunk visits the campsite and the RV slowly sinks into the water, the Hefsleys think if they can save their trip. I like this book a lot because it's hilarious and how the Hefsleys navigated their way from disaster to disaster. Honestly, it was quite a spectacle. Jeff Kinney, the author of this book, worked really hard on the books he wrote to make it funny for all ages. I like the part where Greg's younger brother, Manny, saved the RV from crashing into the bridge by using the steering wheel to turn it around to fit in the broken part of the bridge and how he almost started the wildfire by shooting a flare gun. His antics are quite in entertaining. The Diary of a Wimpy Kid series is great for everyone because it's entertaining for all ages, regardless whether you're young or old. This book is a great pick for you. 
Diary of a Wimpy Kid is something a lot of children and youth around the world grew up with. The world of Greg Heffley was kept millions of children around the world immersed. This left a significant impact on children of this day and age. I would say Diary of a Wimpy Kid has more worldwide recognition than any other teen's novel series. It's only chose it's only close competitor being Harry Potter. I love this book and I would give it a 10 out of 10. Thank you and have a nice day. Sugata Kumariude Suprasita Maya Krishna Niyane Ariila Yana Kavida Arti Tolarti Edvate Lana Edda Petada Vrindavanatele Krishna Ingeni Uru Ariata Saki Undirinikile and the Shangai Lana E Kavida Ammeki Mumbil Pranama Marpichunda E Kavidiude Edanim Chila Varigal Nurtavish Karamai Avadipikino He fled so sad. Abu said the 
golden deer free abu learned the value of love and caring moral of the story is true love last forever thank you music or a poem is the best way to soothe one's mind and soul to brighten our mornings or sunday i would like to call erin bobby for reciting a poem youth and calm by matthew arnold This death and peace indeed is here and is from shame and rest from fear there's nothing can dismarble now the smoothness of that limpid brow but is a calm like this in truth the crowning end of life and youth and when this bond rewards the dead are all debts paid has all been said and is the heart of youth so light its step so firm its eye so bright because on its hot brow there blows a wind of promise and repose from the far grave to which it goes because it had the hope to come one day to harbor in the tomb ah uh, no the bliss youth dreams is won for daylight for the cheerful sun for feeling nerves and living breath you dreams a bliss on this side death it dreams a rest if not more deep more grateful than this marble sleep it hears a voice within it tell comes not life's crown through calm is well this all perhaps which man acquires but this not what a youth decides respected ceo kuria ko sir respected principal teachers and my dear students national youth day is celebrated on 12th of january every year to commemorate the birth anniversary of swami vivekananda The main objective of National Youth Day and the reason for the observance is to create a platform for the youth and address their problems in various spectrums of life. The teachings, philosophies and ideologies of Swami Vivekananda are propagated through universities, schools and colleges on National Youth Day everywhere. This day was chosen to honor the birthday of swami vivekananda one of india's greatest spiritual and social leaders he saw hope for the future in every child and believed that with muscles of iron and nerves of steel they could bring about social change swami himself personified the eternal energy of the youth and a restless quest for truth today Almost 50% of India's population is under the age of 25. The future of the country rides on their shoulders, making celebrations that empower the youngsters of India. Thank you. Let us welcome the navigator of this flagship of knowledge, our honorable principal sir, for sharing his valuable viewpoints. They are respected CEO sir, teachers and loving students. We celebrate National Youth Day on January 12th. It is the birthday of Swami Vivekananda. At present, 50% of the population of India is made up of the youth, which means the future of the land is going to be decided by the youth. As we are working in all the countries of the world and excel in all the walks of life, perhaps the destiny of the whole world may rest in the hands of our youth it is really a wonderful thing to think about if the youth are molded for greater things the future of the world will be bright or it will be dark worldly pleasures and mundane gains alone should not be our driving force the eternal values of justice liberty and fraternity should guide us Moreover spirituality should be inculcated in us 
when you stretch your helping hand to the needy when you feel pain in others sorrow when you become restless while seeing injustice when you have an urge to set everything right starting from you when you empathize with others you become spiritual be spiritual dear children be bold enough to confess your mistakes and correct them be bold enough to get up and pursue from where you fall be bold enough to respect others and their faith and vision future india is yours thank you national anthem evokes feeling of patriotism among us and it remains our nation's glory rich heritage and beauty it represents the belief of a nation and its people let us wind up this morning's assembly by singing our national anthem Thank you.